Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Um, today I'm playing a game that I used, I, I probably wouldn't have recorded until, you know, today. Um, let me check my recording real quick. Okay, yeah, it's recording. Um, this is Tom Clancy's Rainbow Six Siege. Now, before I go any further, I want I want to let you guys know that this is a game with a lot of violence and blood. So if you're not allowed to watch, or watch and or play uh, games games with guns, blood and violence, please click off this video now. And anyone that's still here, welcome, welcome. So let's I I'm gonna do a quick little series on the situations on this game. Uh, I've already played the first two, but let's play the first one. Hopefully we can all go all the way down to heavily fortified. So, here we go. Uh, normal. No, I'm not playing on any, any other difficulty. Alright, let's watch this. You will engage in ten fundamental counterterrorism situations before being deployed. Report to the SAS base in Hereford. You are to infiltrate a kill house and clear the area of enemy combatants. In close quarters combat, operators must rely on situational awareness to locate and identify threats and assets. Secure the area using a slow and methodical sweep. Here, you will face a trained enemy equipped with military grade weapons and explosives. You will need to rely on basic muscle discipline and your ability to reduce exposure to enemy fire by using the environment. Never stop until the threat is neutralized. All right. Eliminate the terrorists. This is FPS issues, but this is, uh, this, this one's not most friendly to my computer. I know I probably shouldn't, but... In a hostage situation, you cannot be slow and methodical. Once you breach the perimeter, you must conduct a violent and dynamic assault in order to extract the hostage from a barricaded house. Use breach charges to quickly infiltrate the building. The physical safety of the asset is paramount. 
Breach charges give you a momentary tactical advantage to neutralize enemies and take control of the asset. Provide cover for the asset as you move to the extraction point, eliminating any hostiles you encounter. Good luck. multiplayer that window is barricadable and not metal sheet. I think going to the front door is the best way on this one. Or at least we have reach right here. I'm gonna check the recording time real quick. We're going only nine minutes. Yeah, let's try the bomb. Bomb defusal. We are facing a bomb threat against a high-value target. It is crucial that you choose an entry point that minimizes your exposure to enemy fire and the time it takes to reach the bomb and disarm it. Repelling is the quickest way to traverse the building allowing you to bypass corridors and stairs. Once you reach the target, you will need to disarm a bomb loaded with an unknown chemical compound. We have equipped you with a diffuser. Set it near the bomb to intercept the signal. Protect the diffuser while it completes the sequence. A bomb must be located and used. Uh, to get this game 
second version of a Paris. And only one bomb. this Rambo Six Siege video and you want more just go ahead and leave a like and yeah see you guys in the next video bye